topic two. The, uh, sorry about your friends, your best friend, and describe about your about about your uh physical character, your friend physical character, and you you share with me about your family. Okay, uh, the people surrounding you. So today, from a topic four, topic five, and topic six, this is a very important topic because you will be find. The all of vocabulary, the all of a uh, topic in test two, where in top uh, in test one, yes, I help you. I try to give you the highest mark ev to everyone, because this is an oral test and I'm your examiner, so your marks in my hand. So I put the highest marks to uh, to everyone. But in test two, okay, there are a written test. Okay, written test. Where you have to write some essay, where you have to choose the best answer. This is a uh, from a multi multiple choice question. So you have to memorize what the meaning of the the word, okay? What the meaning of the vocab? And I can't help you because this is a written test. So uh, the marks uh I should to be to you based on your answer only. All right. So in topic four, five, six. This is a conclude in test two, so please pay attention. This is the quick stuff. Topic four, five, and six. This is a quick stuff where we have to move out of the class, and we have to. Uh, it is about your interaction with somebody in outside. Okay, this is interaction with somebody in outside, and then you can use this sentence, all of sentence. In this topic, to communicate with others in outside, maybe. Uh, so today I just focus in restaurant because this is ordering food and drink. Maybe you can use in um cafeteria, in food court, right? Some of the shop lah, food uh food court. So you can use this sentence in your daily life. You have to practice in your daily life because you have remember the sentence. You have to remember the vocab. Alright, so. I have to start with the first slide uh, about situation in cafeteria. So before I detail about the food and drink, so now I uh, let's show to you the certain situation in cafeteria where you can see there. This is a simple conversation, Ali and Ahmad. Okay, uh, actually I don't use the final uh, the, the formal sentence. Okay, I don't use the formal sentence. It just to help you to communicate in Malaysia community. So this is a, a very a uh, familiar familiar sentence only. Okay, not formal sentence. You can use this sentence to communicate with others. Alright, so this is a situation where Ali try to invite Ahmad to take a breakfast. Right, Ali ingin mengajak Ahmad. That means Ali try to invite Ahmad. Mengajak. That means invite Ahmad. Uh, to take a breakfast all right so uh, i need someone to be ali i need someone to be ahmad and then because i want to listen your your pronunciation all right so uh, please make sure uh, don't forget about the about the, about the good pronunciation so may i call uh, li shengnan li shengnan are you here li shengnan i'm here i'm here doctor Okay, Li Shengnan, you try to be Ali, then uh, Yuan, Yuan Yuan Bo. Yuan Yuan Bo, are yes, you there? Yes, Doctor. Okay, Yuan, you try to be Ahmad, right? Okay. So now go ahead. Uh, Salma, Salma Pagi Ahmad, Awamahu um, Pertriker Mana. Hi, Sima Pagi. Saya ma mahu pergi ke kafeteria. Uh, adaka awaka, uh, adaka awa suda persa apa. Berlum, saya saga lapa. Jum kita saripa. Sorry, party cafe taria faculty bahasa modern than komunikasi. Ah, ya, um, bola, um, jonga, saya, 
mahu makan nasi lemak. Saya pula suka makan roti kan kana kana kanan dan again kanan yuan kanai or kanan pronounce c what is it kanan are you sure kanai pronounce c c pronounce c kanan no pronounce c in bahasa melayu is cha cha nai cha nan yes Okay, okay, continue. Okay. Tanan dan te teha tarik tarik. Ya, saya saya juga uh, mahu jom kita pergi uh, sekarang. All right, very good. Terima kasih. So, uh, let's I call for the second couple. Huang Chin, Huang Chin, Huang Chin. Are you here, Huang Chin? Yeah, I'm okay. here. Yes, Wang and Tao Fang Zing. Are you here, Tao Fang Zing? Yeah, yes, teacher. All right, so please read again for us. Okay, uh, no, no, no. Uh, Wang Qing try to be Ali, Tao Fang Zing to be Ahmad. Okay? Okay, okay. okay. read again. Uh, Salama Pak, uh, um, Paki uh, Ahmad. Uh, Wakham Mahu Pergi Kemana Hai, Salamal Pagi Saya Mahu Pergi ke Cafe Toria Ataka Awa Suta Purwa Ursawakai Benlu Saya Saka Sata Lapa Jum Kita Sarwapa D. Cafeteria Faculty Bahasa Modern Dan Komu Lika Komu Lika Ya Bola Joka Saya Mahu Maka Nas Si Lamaka. Saya juga suka makan roti chalai dan terdorit. Ya, saya juga mahu jual kaki penggi sakara. Alright. Terima kasih. Okay. Sama-sama. Alright. So, uh, thank you. Uh, both of couple. Alright. So, uh, I hope you understand what the this conversation. They try to discuss about what. Okay. So, actually, um, uh, in this dialogue, I not to provide anything to you. So, let's try to uh, translate together. Okay. I'm not provide to all of you because this is a topic four. So I think some of what you understand, like a slamat pagi. No, right. So let me try to translate together. Okay. Ali. Selamat pagi. That means it's good. What is it? Selamat pagi. What is it? Good morning. morning. Yes. Good morning, Ahmad. Awak mahu pergi ke mana? What is it? Awak, this means you, is it? You, awak. Yeah. Mahu, what is it? Want. Yes. You want, and then, what is it? Where are you want to go? Mana, this means where, okay? Where are you want to go? Good morning, Ahmad. Where are you want to go? So you can see this is the symbol, a question. So that means this is the question. So Ahmad say, "Hi, selamat pagi." Ahmad reply, and then saya mahu saya what is it saya? Me, I. Yes, I mahu want. I want to go to what is it? Cafeteria. What is it? Cafeteria is same. Cafeteria is cafeteria. Okay. 
uh, the same pronunciation but the different spelling. I want to go to cafeteria. Adakah awak sudah bersarapan? So you can see this is a symbol. So that means is this is a question. So what what uh, Ahmad try to asking Ali? Adakah awak uh, sudah bersarapan? Uh, Have you had a breakfast? Okay, sarapan. That means it's breakfast. Where everyone just take for early morning only. Okay. Have you had a breakfast? Belum. What is it? Belum. Yes or no? Belum. What is no. it? No. No. Yes or no? No. No. Okay. No. Not yet. I have no. Okay. Saya sangat lapar. Why is it lapar? Hungry. I'm so yes. Because no, right? No. I'm so hungry. Okay. Saya sangat lapar. Lapar. That means hungry. Yo. That means it's come on or let's go. Okay. Kita. That means we. Okay. Awak, you, saya, I, kita, both. Alright. You and me. Kita. Kita. Sarapan, what is it? I, I, I talked before that. Breakfast. Breakfast. Okay. Come on. We take a breakfast. In, uh, at cafeteria, faculty, bahasa modern and komunikasi. Okay. Come on, let's go. We have a breakfast at cafeteria, faculty, bahasa modern and komunikasi. Yeah. What do you mean? Yeah. 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 Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Yes, of course. Yeah. Boleh juga. What is it? Boleh juga. Hmm? Yes, boleh. That means is, yes, I can. Can. Boleh, I mean can. Yes, I can. Saya mahu makan. What is it? Saya mahu makan. I want to, oh, I want to, to, to eat. I want to eat. Yes, eat. I want to eat. Eat. Nasi mm -hmm. lemak. Okay, this is the name of the food. Okay, the name of the food actually uh, no need to translate in English because this is uh, the name of the food, right? So, I want to eat nasi lemak. Okay. And then Ahmad say, Saya pula, me too. Okay. Saya pula, suka, me too. Like to eat roti canai. Okay. Don't forget pronounce C, eh. I like to eat roti canai and teh tarik. Teh tarik. Okay. Ya. Yeah. Saya juga mahu. Yes. I want to. Or me too. Yes, me too. Jom kita pergi sekarang. What is it? Let's go now. Sekarang. That means it's now. Okay. Sekarang that means it's now. Okay. So, uh, I hope you understand what they are trying to discuss. And most important. Alright. This is a remember listening. Uh, please pay attention guys. Listen carefully. Alright. In topic 4, listen carefully. It is a basic for guidance to you for make assignment number two. Okay. Because uh, you already uh, have, uh, you already uh, in progress to make assignment number one, right? Some of you already submit to me assignment number one. How to submit assignment number one? You have to open the ad modo. You can see the, the button click submission. You just click at the button and then upload your file there and then settle. Okay, so now we are talking about assignment number two. This is a guidance only. I will give uh, the detail assignment number two after uh, everyone submit already. Uh, everyone submit assignment number one. All right, so listen carefully. It is a basic for guidance to you to make it assignment number two. So assignment number two, you are going to role play. Role play. So even we are in a COVID-19 season, so nobody can go to everywhere. Nobody can go to outside. But don't worry. You can use your creativity. Uh, try to create the situation at the cafeteria or, or some, some else or some place. All right. So you have to uh, create the situation and then uh, try to role play to make it assignment number two. So you can use this template to make it your assignment number two. Please, please, and please don't try to mix your own script because some of you 
some of couple they try to make uh, their own script and then they try to translate uh, in English okay in, in bahasa Melayu okay they try to create their own script and then try to translate in bahasa Melayu so what happened your sentence is uh, almost almost not logic and almost wrong so i share with you last semester i have a one couple they try to make their own script and then you know what what they just try to say uh, actually okay actually i understand in english they want to buy um you know uh what we call it sunglasses okay you know sunglasses the black color all right sunglasses they want to buy a two sunglasses okay they try to create um their own script and then someone go to the a shop and the customer said for the seller i want to buy two sunglasses so when they try to translate in bahasa melayu you know what the meaning is the meaning is uh, i want to buy a cup of sun you know cup cup of tea and sun all right so that means mean you you have to use this template and then try to replicate you have to change the name of the faculty, the name of the cafeteria, the name of the, um, the actress. But you can use this, this template. Okay? Please don't try to make your own template. Sometimes this is not logic. Okay? So uh, this is the, the mistake makes you drop your marks. Right? So I hope you understand. So they have a lot of situation. So you can choose the situation from topic 4, topic 5 and topic 6. So which one is easy to you? So I've shared, uh, maybe they have more than 10 situation. So you can use which one is situation best for you. All right. So I just uh, explained to you about your assignment. Memory. So you can choose which one the best situation <clears throat> and then try to discuss with your partner after this. All right. So settle. Let's uh, go to the next slide. All right. So I present to you, this is the name of a famous drinking drink in Malaysia. So that one is a black color, uh, same uh, with you, but but in Bahasa Melayu, we call with another name, right? So that one is a, a coffee, right? This is a plain coffee, okay? But in Bahasa Melayu, you have to see kopi o. Kopi o. If you just say kopi only, you will get this one. The coffee mixed with um, some of meal, okay? The coffee mixed with some of meal. So if you want to the plain coffee, you have to say kopi o, right? And that one, the, the right side, this is a teh tarik. For those who didn't, who didn't know what, what the meaning of teh tarik. So the teh tarik, you have, uh, how to making it? You have a skill to pull and down, pull and down the water, all right? Until you get the bubble like this one. Okay, so settle. So now this is a, this is a vocabulary. Uh, so I just take out from this situation, okay? I just pick up from the situation. You can see I try to bowl there, okay? So pergi, I mean it's go. Belum. I uh, do you have a breakfast? Not yet. Have a not. That's why it's belum. Okay, belum. Or uh, maybe your your lecturer asking you, uh, you done your assignment? Yes, you can answer. Belum. That means it's have not. Maybe someone asking you, so if you if the answer is no, you have to say belum. Okay, belum or tidak. So hungry, that means it's lapar. Breakfast is sarapan. Okay, one is mahu, I want, I want. That means it's saya mahu, saya mahu, mahu. Okay, eat, makan. Okay, and I like, that means I suka, saya suka. Okay, saya suka, what you like it. All right. So you have to remember this vocab and you have to use in your daily life. Okay, if you try to use in your daily life, that's when you try to memorize the vocabulary there. All right, so now, this is a vocab to help you to build the dialogue in your daily life. So now, I'm not selling to you all of food names. Okay, so this is just a Malaysia signature foods only. Okay, this is the, the name of the food in Malaysia. Very famous, Amos. But some of that you will be fine. It's your, your country. All right. 
Okay, so the most important, I just want to listen your pronunciation only. All right, try to read the name of the food. Uh, nowadays, uh, who can imagine, um, if you come in Malaysia, you want to ordering some of food, maybe you can use this food in Bahasa Melayu. All right, so I would like to call someone, try to read this uh, name of the food for us. Zhang Junwu. Zhang Junwu. Are you there? Yes, doctor. Okay, try to read one by one until and the end. Okay. Roti China. Mm -hmm. mm, nasi Lamak. Mere Gorin. Cream Meh. Again? Cream Meh. Maybe I'm not sure this. Okay, okay, try. Kuwe Muwe. Kuwe. Okay. Kuwe. Muwe. Kuwe Muwe. Kuwe Muwe. That means it's more than one visit. Okay. If you just say Kuwe, Kuwe, that means it's visit. Okay. Kuwe, that means it's visit. But I try, um, we have to, the double word. Kuwe Muwe. So that means it's uh, more than one visit. No no yes. Continue. Papara mm, nasi. Yes. Nasi sayang. Uh, nasi ayam. Okay. Mm, roti talu. Okay. Asam perta. Yes. Mm, la. Lakasa. Laksa. Alasa. Okay. Nasa. La. You have to pronounce K. Laksa. Laksa. Mm. Mm. Me curry. Mm. Nasin Korean. Mm. Sa. Sapa. Palakchan. Again, again. Sambal. <clears throat> Sampa Palach Chan. Mm. Mm. Rintan. Okay. Sumaya. Tom Yam. No, Tom Yam. Not Tom Yam. Tom Yam. Tom Yam. Okay. Mm. Chan Tom. Mm. Chun. Mm. Chun. Buah. Just, I, I'm, I'm not sure. Just buah. Just buah. Okay. Just buah. Mm, turn tarik. Mm. Kopi panas. Mm. Air. 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 Not air. Air, air that means uh, the oxygen. Uh, air. 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 Batu campo. Again, champor, how to say? Champor. Champor. Mm -hmm. Last one. Mm. So, so. Yes, very good. Your pronunciation, all right? Very clear. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Terima kasih. So, I just explain what I mean in, uh, the food there, all right? In English. Roti canai, still roti canai. This is a very famous in in um indian people right like that one i have to show you the image this one okay you can see okay this is a roti chanai i believe you will be found also in your country but now you have to know the name in bahasa melayu nasi lemak okay who had a try nasi lemak already who have a try nasi lemak already huh do you have experience eat nasi lemak can you share for me about this? Nobody try? If you've been in Malaysia, you have tried to nasi lemak. Okay, nasi lemak like this one. Okay, you can see that one. This is a plain rice. And then they put a sauce. They put a cucumber, some of eggs, and a little fish, and some of, uh, what is it we call it? Some of nuts. Okay. All right. This is a nasi lemak. And then, Mi goreng. This is a noodle fries. Noodle, no, 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 noodle fries. Okay, this is a very famous in China also. 
Aku eh mue. This is a dessert. Okay. Uh, bubur nasi. Bubur nasi. That means it's porridge. Bubur nasi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You will be found bubur nasi in McDonald's already. Okay. If you go to McDonald's, you, you have to say, I want bubur nasi or bubur ayam. Okay. Bubur nasi ayam. Bubur nasi. Yes. If you want to try to go to McDonald's and try. Okay. Bubur nasi. Nasi ayam. Who know nasi ayam? What is it? This is very famous. Nasi ayam. What is it? Hello, everyone. Who know what nasi ayam? Uh, chicken rice. Yes, okay. like this one. Chicken rice. Okay. Ah. Uh, okay, and then roti telur. Okay, roti telur. That means it uh, uh, toast, uh, but they put a sum of eggs. Asam pedas, the soup, uh, the taste is uh, sweet sour. Laksa, this is a noodle, noodle, but uh, the noodle is, is a white color. They make it from a rice, rice noodle. Mi curry, uh, also a noodle, but they put a uh, sum of a curry. Nasi goreng, I mean is, what is it? Uh, fried rice, fried rice. Okay, sambal belacan. That means it's sauce, so spicy and very hot. Rendang. Okay, uh, like a curry, but sometimes this is a uh, dry. Tom yum. This is a soup. They mix from a seafood. Chendol. Chendol. I don't know how to describe to you. All right, juice buah. Juice buah. That means it's a um, juice from a um, fruit. Like a watermelon, orange juice, pineapple juice, so many more. Teh tarik. Okay, teh tarik like the one I already explained to you. This is a teh tarik. You can see the bubble there. Kopi panas. Okay, if you say kopi panas, you will get the brown color there. If you have, you if you say kopi o, you will get the black coffee. Okay. Air batu campo. Okay, please try to translate what the meaning of air batu campur. If you translate air batu campur, the meaning is water, water mixed stone. Water mixed stone. Alright. So actually, air batu campur, that means is ice blended like this one. Okay. Ah. So, and the last one is susu. What is it? Susu. Who know? Milk. Yes. Yeah. Milk. Milk. Okay. So that's all. This is about Malaysia teenager food. All right. I'm not promote. I'm not promote the foods in Malaysia. I just um inform to you because you will become in Malaysia. So maybe easy to you to ordering food and drink in Bahasa Melayu when you come in a restaurant or other cafeteria. All right. So already. So now, uh, this is a conversation in the cafeteria. Uh, the first situation Ali and Ahmad that's mean we are not in cafeteria we want to go to cafeteria so now <clears throat> this is the conversation in the cafeteria so what you have to say with your partner maybe you will ask your partner you can use this dialogue Linda awak suka makan apa so I think the word is already I, I explained to you what the meaning word by word maybe fang wan are you here fang wan Fang Wan, are you there? Doctor, I mean, I want Fang right? Ah, yes. Okay, Fang Wan. Okay, Fang Wan. Okay. Please help me to translate the sentence there. Linda. What, what do you want to eat? Yes, very good. Okay, definitely. Bagus. What do you want to eat? Awa, that means you. Like, like, makan, eat, what? Okay, uh, but the Bahasa Malaysia destruction is, is not the, the same in English. Okay, sometimes they are, they are, they, they rearrange not, not same in English. Okay, Linda, what do you like to eat? Or what do you want to eat? Some, that like is similar lah. What do you want to eat? What do you like to eat? Suka, that means it like. What do you like to eat? And then, um, the partner of the Linda answer. Saya suka makan nasi goreng ayam. Okay, Fang Wan, what is it? Saya suka I, makan. Hmm? I like to eat uh, chicken rice. Yes, 
I like to eat the chicken rice. Okay. Uh, you can, <coughs> if you know the name of the food in English, yes, you can use. But if you don't know, you can use the same name in English and Bahasa Melayu. Okay. I like to eat nasi goreng ayam. Terima kasih, Fang Wan. Uh, Brendan, Brendan, are you there? Yes. Okay, Brendan, now, please help me try to translate the second sentence. What it is. What is it, Brendan? The second sentence, what the meaning? Um, I want to drink. Again, again, what is it? Um, I want to drink. Drink? Drinks what? This is a question. Azik, what do you want to drink? Yes. They are talking, what do you want to drink? Yeah. Yes. They want to talk about the drinking. What you like to drink? Okay. Drink. What your favorite drink? Awak suka. Okay. So, Brandon, the answer should be what? In, uh, in Malay or English? In Malay. In English, um, sorry, in English, in English, sorry. They already write down in okay. Malay. I want to drink uh, na panas, panas. What is it? Kopi O. You miss Kopi O. I want to drink panas only. You What? Panas is hot. You want to drink what? Brendan. I want um, to drink Kopi O. Panas. Coffee, hot coffee. Yes, hot coffee. Okay, hot coffee. But you have to say O. Oh, okay, hot coffee in English. Okay. But uh, in Bahasa Melayu, that's why I told you uh, the name of the drink and food, no need to change. You can use the, the same name. Okay, kopi O panas. That means brown coffee or black coffee. Everyone, kopi O panas. Brown coffee or black coffee? Black coffee. Black, coffee. black coffee. Yes, black coffee. So you should you should be to, to say kopi o. That means black coffee. If you, if you just say kopi panas only, you will get the brown coffee. Alright, so Ravi, awak mahu makan apa? Same with Linda. The dialogue same with Linda. What you want to eat? That one is what you like to eat. I want to eat roti canai. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Number four, the last one. The same with Hazik. Maria, awak suka minum teh tarik? Do you, do you like to drink teh tarik? And then Maria don't like. So he, uh, she say, saya tidak suka teh tarik. Okay, I don't like teh tarik. Tidak suka, that means don't like. Okay, tidak suka mean I don't like teh tarik. Rasanya sangat manis. Okay, because of? The taste is very sweet. Okay, taste is very sweet. I don't like teh tarik. All right, so now I I uh, share with you. Wait, I share with you the expressing of taste. This is a very important, eh? Because you will be find the word in your test too. Okay, expressing taste, and then I will asking you in topic five because topic five we will talk about uh, some of fruit and vegetable. And then I will ask you one by one. How about a banana taste? How about durian taste? So you have to answer me with Bahasa Melayu. How to answer? Yes, we have to uh, to learn today. Okay. All right. So the first of all, you have to know what the name of the taste. The first is delicious. Delicious, that means it's sedap. Masha Allah. Sedap. Lazat. I like it. That means it's delicious. Saya suka. Okay, sweet like, sweet like what? Please give me the example. What is it? Sweet like? Everyone, sweet like? Sweet like? Sugar. Sweet like? Uh, candy. Sweet like? Some more? Yes. Fruit. Meat. Uh, meat. What is it? Me. <laughs> sweet like? 
什么？ What is honey? Is it? Okay, sweet. That means it's manis. Manis. Sweet like your smile. So sweet. Okay. Manis. That means it's sweet. Salty. That means it's masin. Salty. You put too much salty. So salty like what? Salty like cell, of course. Sal uh, salty like ocean. Ocean water. Salty like what? Please share with us. Uh, fun fries or potato chips. Okay. So many. What you, okay. And then bitter. Okay. You, you give me the answer. Bitter like what? Medicine. Medicine, of course. Okay. The only vitamin C. <laughs> okay. Bitter like medicine. Samo? What is it? Bitter like? Mm, 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 what is it? Bitter like what? Coffee. Yeah, coffee. Okay. Uh, Sometimes maybe a Nescafe. Okay? Yeah. Because you forget to put the sugar. So they are so bitter. Alright, masam. Sur. Sur like what? Lemon. Lemon, of course. Alright. And so like what? What is it? Some form of vitamin C. Yes. Okay. So sp spicy. Spicy like what? Spicy like what, everyone? Share with me. Sauce. Tomato? Sauce? Chili. Chili? Pepper? Crispy? Like? Kentucky Fried Chicken. Crispy like cookies. Alright. So sweet is manis. Salty is masin. Masin. Bitter is pahit. Pahit. Sua is masam. Masam. Spicy is pedas. Okay. Crispy is garing. When you eat, uh, when you try to find something, the people surrounding you can hear what you try to. Okay, crispy. All right. So how about less? Not too. That means it's kurang. Okay, kurang. That means it's less. Kurang manis. Kurang masin. Kurang pahit. Kurang masam. Kurang pedas. Kurang garing. Less sweet. Less salty, less bitter, less sour, less spicy, and less crispy. Okay? This vocab is very important. That's why I push you to remember this vocabulary. Okay, because I told you again, in topic two, I can't help you because this is a writing test. Alright, so maybe I can, I try to test you. I try to, I try to delete this part. And then I asking you what I mean, yeah. Uh, who Kiwin? Who Kiwin? Kiwin? Yes, doctor. Okay, tell me what the meaning of delicious, sweet, salty, and the end. What is it? Okay, um, delicious means so that. Sweet. Sweet means many. Salty. And salty means. Massing. Bitter. Bitter means pahit. Sour. Sour means masam. Spicy. Spicy means pedas. Crispy. Crispy means garing. Less. Less means kurang. Yes, kurang. Very good. Tao Fang Zing. Please tell me in English. Don't look at the note, eh? Okay, what is the meaning of sedap? Sedap, sweet. Mm, delicious. Manis? Ah, uh, it's delicious. Manis is sweet. Sweet. Masin? Masin. Uh, 
Pasti mari di. Failed to be. I still remember. Tau Fang Zeng. Tau Fang Zeng. What yeah. must say? Must say. Like uh, potato chips. I told you before. Oh, salty. Yeah. Don't forget the word. Okay. Yeah. Pahit. Uh. Sour. No. Uh, pahit. What is it? Pahit. Bitter. Pardon? Bitter. 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 Yes. Masak. Masam. Sour. So, so, so. Yes. Pedas. Uh, uh, spicy. Spicy. Curry. Uh, crispy. Last one, kurang. What is it? Uh, lot. Least, least, least. Less. Uh, less. Uh, less. Less. <laughs> less lah, not less. Less. Uh. Okay. Thank you, Tang Fauzing. All right. Okay. So <clears throat> now this is what you have to do. Okay. So this is a short sentence. What you have to do. I give you uh everyone five minutes. I think it's enough. Okay. I give you five minutes. Try to find the the meaning of the is sentence. Kopi ini sangat manis. Kopi ini kurang manis. Kopi ini pahit. Okay, everyone. Try to translate each sentence. Is each, each sentence start from the first picture until the last picture. Okay, and then after this, I would like to call name of you one by one, and you have to share with me what the meaning. Alright, so now it's 8.52. I will come back at 9 a.m.
Okay, everyone. I hope you done. Mana pencil Umi? Mana pencil Umi tadi? Okay, everyone. I hope you done. So, I call your name. Please read the sentence in Bahasa Melayu. And then give me the meaning. Alright. So, I think this is a very easy. Uh, Ran Li Jiao. Ran Li Jiao. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, please explain about the coffee. Uh, co um, I speak English or? Read first and then uh, English. Translate by English. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Uh, coffee um, Satam, Anis, Kopi, Korea, Crown, Anis, Kopi, Pahita, Pahita. The meaning is uh, this coffee is very sweet. Uh, this coffee is not very sweet. This coffee is bitter. Okay. Thank you, Rani Jiao. Yang Yuele. Thank you. Yes, doctor. Okay, tell about the cotton price. A potato chip there. Uh, cotton goreng ini sang sang massing. Uh, this price is a very salty. Kanta gor ring in cool round um uh, massing this fries is less uh less salty okay terima kasih uh her shalu her shalu yes daughter i'm here okay about the sauce sambal okay. sambal in the sanget pedas Sambal ini sangat sedap. Sambal ini crown pedas. Uh, okay. The meaning is uh, the food is spicy. And uh, the second one again, is... Again, again. The first one is what? Again? The first one is the what? The first one is the food is spicy. Spicy or very spicy? <clears throat> Uh, very spicy. Okay, second one. The second one is the food is very delicious. Mm -hmm. the, the third one is the food is not, uh, is less spicy. Okay. Less spicy. All right. Terima kasih. Okay, actually, this is, yes, of course, this is a food. So the name of food is sambal. Okay, if you, do, if you don't know the meaning in English, you can use the same name in Bahasa Melayu. This sambal or this sauce. Alright, terima kasih. Okay. So, lemon, terima kasih. Alright, so lemon, they have the only one. So, lemon ini sangat masam. That means it's this lemon is very sour. Okay, so roti canai. Uh, kin yufe. Kin yufe. Kin yufe. All right, roti canai. Roti canai ini sangat garing. Mm -hmm. Roti canai ini kurang garing. Read again, roti canai or roti canai? Uh, yes, uh, roti canai or roti canai? Roti canai. Mm -hmm. Roti canai. Okay, meaning? Uh, the mini is, uh, this roti is very crisp, crisp, uh, this, uh, this, uh, uh, bread, uh, bread is less crisp, uh, crisp. Okay, terima kasih. All right, so, the last one. Yeah. The last one, uh, Zhang Ziting. Are you there? Yeah. Okay, Zhang Ziting. The last one, yeah. spaghetti. 
Okay. Uh, uh, last one. Yes, about spaghetti. Yes, last one. Okay. Uh, spaghetti. Uh, in the uh, setup. Uh, spaghetti in the uh, sangeta uh, setup. Uh, spaghetti in the uh, Quran uh, setup. Like uh, means uh, this uh, star spaghetti is delicious. Uh, spaghetti uh, is very uh, tasty. Uh, uh, this uh, star uh, heat is less uh, tasty. All right. Sedap. That yeah. means it's delicious. Eh? All right. Terima yeah. kasih. Terima kasih. So finish. All right. So mm, let's move for the part. How to place the order. Okay. So just imagine you are in restaurant. So how to place the order. So I give you the second uh, situation. So you can choose which one situation you like it to make your assignment number two. Okay. This situation, um, Amira and Razif mahu memesan makanan dan minuman. That means Amira and Razif, they want to place the order. Okay. Alright, so I need a three of you. <coughs> Zhang Hando. Zhang Hando. Yeah, yes, doctor. You be pelayan. Okay. Then Liu Yang. Liu Yang. Yes, doctor. You be Amira. Yes. Then okay. Sheng Wei. Zhang Sheng Wei. Yes. You be Razif. Okay, try to read. Uh, Salamat Hakni Hali. Uh, Bola Saya um, Biu Pasanan. Um, hi, Salamat Donga Hali. Saya Mahu Makan Nasi Golang Ayam Dam Minum Ela Dam Bikai. Air. Ava Bola. Again, air. air. Air, air, tembikai. Apa pula? Um, saya pula mahu mem mem masa dua set roti bakar dan uh, set kawan kopi. Set kawan or set cawan? Again, set set cawan. Yes. Sejauhan kopi panas. Uh, itu sahaya. Uh, <coughs> ya, itu sahaja. Terima kasih. Okay, so pelayan ke sama-sama. Sama-sama. Alright, terima kasih. Okay, all of you. So, um. Uh, this is where Amira and Razif, they want to place the order. What the meaning of pelayan? That means it's uh, waiters. Okay. Waiters say, good afternoon. Tengah hari, that means good, good afternoon. Boleh saya ambil pesanan? Can I take an order? Hi, selamat tengah hari. Hi, good afternoon too. Saya mahu makan nasi goreng ayam. I thought this is a very easy. I want to eat nasi ayam dan minum air tembikai and watermelon juice for drink. And watermelon juice for drink. How about you? Awak pula, how about you? Saya pula mahu memesan dua set roti bakar. I want to order two set of toast. <clears throat> I mean it's roti bakar. And a cup of hot coffee. Okay. A cup of hot coffee. Se cawan. It's one. Okay. Se cawan kopi pangan. That's all. That's all. Kena tunggu raya dulu. Ya. Itu saja. Yes. That's all. Terima kasih. Sama-sama. Okay. Finish already. Very simple. Alright. So. Let's go. Move to the, for the next slide. So now we learn about asking about price. So this is a very tough where you have to remember about the numbers. Okay, start from the number one 
basically number one until number 10. This is the very basic. So now I have to teach, teach you uh, number one until 1,000. All right, so before that, I provide to you the simple situation. This is the third situation. Anita mahu membeli goreng pisang. This is how to asking about price. Okay, if you want to ask him about price, you can refer this dialogue. Okay, penjual Anita. Penjual, that means is seller. Anita as a customer. Anita mahu membeli pisang goreng. So, penjual say, selamat petang. Boleh saya bantu? The meaning is, good evening. Can I help you? Boleh saya bantu? Maybe you can use this sentence in everywhere. Okay, maybe you can, uh, you see the someone, they have a problem. So, you can use this sentence. Boleh saya bantu? Can I help you? And then Anita say, Hi, selamat petang. Berapakah harga pisang goreng ini? So, how to asking the price? Yes, this is the this is the question. Okay, you can see the, the I try to bold the words. Berapakah harga pisang goreng ini? When uh, you look at the answer start from berapakah, that means the answer should be the number. That means you have to use the number as an answer. Berapakah harga pisang goreng ini? So now uh, Anita asking how much the banana fries. So seller say harganya dua ringgit dua. Number two, dua ringgit untuk lima ketul pisang. That means the price is two ringgit for pies, uh, five pieces. Two ringgit for five pieces. Okay, baiklah. That means okay. Kalau begitu, berikan saya sepuluh ketul pisang. Please give me ten pieces. So, how uh, much Anita have to pay? Jumlahnya total four ringgit. Okay. This is a change. This is a balance. Ini duit baki. Maybe Anita give five ringgit. So they have a one ringgit balance. Ini duit baki. Terima kasih sama-sama. Right? So this template you can also uh, choose if you want to like it. This, this situation you can use choose to make it your assignment number two. So now let's begin. Let's start uh, how to mention about the price. Okay. So we start. From the coin, 10 sen, 10 sen, 10 sen, okay? We have to say 10 sen, not 10 sen. Even, this is the number one. 10, 10 sen, no ringgit there. You can see this is a zero. So you, you have to say 10 sen only. So now, they have uh, one ringgit, one ringgit, no sen. So that means it's 1 ringgit. Or seringgit. Satu ringgit or seringgit. Alright. Ten ringgit. Sepuluh ringgit. Okay. One ringgit, sepuluh ringgit. And then one is one hundred fifty. Seratus lima puluh ringgit. Okay. Because lima puluh, we call it lima puluh. So you put one hundred, seratus lima puluh ringgit. This one is for uh, four digits. One thousand fifth ring, uh, fifth hundred. Seratus, seribu lima ratus ringgit. And the last one, one thousand, uh, one hundred fifty thousand. Okay, one hundred fifty thousand. So how to mention the price? This is the way how to mention the price. So. Uh, you are about to tell the price. So, uh, in your paper, you should write the price in, in this figure like you want. Okay, you should write. In your paper, your test too, uh, sometimes they put the sum object and they put the tag, the price. So, you should write down how, how many price there. Okay, so you have to write down the answer like this one. Okay, uh, they put. Okay, let's say they put the books and then they put the price is 10 ringgit. So how to say 10 ringgit? So you should be right 10 ringgit. The answer should be like that one. Okay, or maybe the question they put, uh, they try to spell the price like this one. So you should be write down the price like this. Okay. 
All right. So now we are learned about the numbers. Okay. So this is a, the basic number you have remember. This is a very basic number. We start from the 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So may I know the numbers in Bahasa Melayu for someone? Okay, please tell me what the numbers in Bahasa Melayu. Wang Zining. Wang Zining, are you there? Wang Zining, are you there? Wang Zining. Wang Zining. Okay. Um, maybe I will let you call the and others. All right. Uh, Jin Hui. Yes, I'm here. Okay, Jin Hui, please read for me the numbers. Start from number one and nine in Bahasa Melayu. Okay. Um, satu, um, dua, tiga, empat, lima, enam, tujuh, lapan, sembilan, sepuluh, sebelas, dua belas, tiga belas, Yes, very good. Okay. This is a very basic and simple. You have to know. So now this is a tin. Okay, tin. How to write down the tin? The same words, the same number there. But you have to put belas. Okay. Sepuluh. Okay. Sepuluh. Dua puluh. Tiga puluh. Empat puluh. Lima puluh. Until a hundred. So one one. Not satu belas. But sebelas. Okay. Number two and nine, almost same. Dua belas, tiga belas, right? Maybe I would like to call someone, try to read. Zuwe. Uh, Zuwe. Uh, yeah, that's I'm here. Yes, yeah, try to read the team numbers. The team. Okay. Um, tiga, tiga, uh, tiga belas. Uh, uh, Fourteen. Fourteen. Uh, and part, and part of mm -hmm. <clears throat> and the fifteen Lima Balas, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and the sixteen, uh, uh, Nama Balas, all right, uh, seventeen, and uh, two, two, um, two, 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 uh, la la ban la ban balas and the uh, and the nineteen some uh some uh, uh some bilan balas. Yes, very good. Okay, so this is a teen. So now we're going to the big number. All right. So dua puluh. Okay, dua puluh, tiga puluh, empat puluh, lima puluh. So you should put the the puluh, this is a mandatory, like a belas. Okay. So if you uh, if you 22, so dua puluh, dua. If dua puluh only, you, yes. If you if if 20 only, you have to say dua puluh only. But they have the number, so you have to say dua puluh, dua. Okay, maybe I have to someone try to read for me what the number is. Uh, Tao Fang Zing, again. Tao Fang Zin? Yeah, I'm here. Oh. Yes, try to read the number there. Uh, 31 is Tika Blue Satu. Mm -hmm. 24 is Empa Blue Blue Okay, the last one. Last one. Uh, Seventy-six is Lima Plu. Uh, Sixty. Uh, the last one is uh lighting light. Uh, what is it? Uh, 
Very good. Terima kasih. So if you don't know the basic number, you have a problem how to read the number in Bahasa Melayu. Okay, this one is seratus. Okay, seratus, dua ratus, tiga ratus, empat ratus, until thousand. So, this one is seratus, sebelas. Okay, so how to read? Hmm. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Sun Hao Chiang. Sun Hao Chiang. Hao Chiang. Okay. Try to read. Yes, yes, doctor. Which one? Oh, tung dua ratus dua dua belas. Next. And. Tiga ratus dua puluh tiga, empat ratus satu, lima ratus lima puluh enam, tujuh ratus lima belas, lapan lapan ratus tiga puluh. Ah, which one? Okay, and the last one? The last one is sembilan ratus sembilan puluh sembilan. Yes, this is very easy, right? Hmm, yes. <laughs> okay, terima kasih. <laughs> right, so now we're talking about the thousand. Okay, seribu, seribu, seratus, sepuluh. Okay, alright. So I need uh, someone try to read a number ni. Okay, the three number there. Okay, maybe I would like to call Ran Li Jiao. Ran Li Jiao. Ran Li Jiao. Are you there? Yeah, daughter. Okay, try to read the three number there. What is yeah, it? Uh, what is it? Uh, uh, dar, uh, daribo siratas, um, 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 tapu, tapu satu. Okay. Uh, tinggal ribu, uh, tinggal ribu dah, uh, ratus tinggal puluh, um, um, puluh, uh, puluh, lima puluh, uh, um, empat ribu, sembilan, uh, se, uh, seratus satu. Terima kasih. Song Yiran. Song Yiran. Yes, yes, that's her. Okay, try to read the three numbers there. Uh, lima ribu, eh? Uh, lima ribu tu, dua ratus lima puluh tujuh. Mm hmm. Then? Uh, on, on a ribu... Seratus bolas. Okay. One more. And and two jam libu seratus lapan puluh lima. Yes, very good. Terima kasih. Uh, Dao Hong Chen. Dao Hong Chen. Yeah. Okay. Two numbers. Read. Two? Mm-hmm. Try to read. Uh, Again? This is the, no, the second last. La Paribu. The second last. La Paribu. La la gai bu, oh la bai bu tiga ratus an a i an pulu. The last one. 
Last one again, Sim one more. Sim Simple Rebo, Simple Reto, Simple. Sembilan puluh sembilan. Puluh simple. Okay, so this is the numbers where in test two you will be find the question like this one. Okay, maybe they put the number so you have to write down the answer or they put the other uh, the, the word number by word so you have to write down the numbers. All right, so finish already. So before I end our class, I have to take a five, uh, uh, two minute to show of you about your exercise number four. Okay, you will be find this exercise in your Edmodo account. Okay, all right. So I before I explain, I tell you no need to submit. Yeah, you just keep it. But this is a mandatory. You have to fill. You have to complete the all of exercise because uh, in weeks nine we have to discuss all of exercise together. All right. So they have a three part of question. So the first the first one. Please complete the dialogue using the vocabulary below. So I already teach you what the what the meaning of the vocab there. Baki, duet baki. What the meaning of duet baki? That means is a balance or change. Six pack, six kotak. That means is six box. Berapakah? Should be answer. Uh, the answer should be use the number. So this is the number thirty six ringgit. And what the meaning of hendak? Like or one, okay. Uh, you have to revise, uh, from your notes, okay. Fill in the blank what the best answer, and then the second one. You have to translate the sentence below in Malay language. So I remind again, please don't use the Google translation. But if you want to use a Google trans translation, it still can. You can do, but don't please don't write the whole sentence. Maybe you don't know they just want a sentence only. You forgot about the meaning of spicy. Yes, you can write down about the spicy only. This sambal. Look look at this sambal belacan. No need to translate what sambal belacan. Use the same name. Sambal belacan ini. What the meaning of delicious in Bahasa Melayu? What is it? Oh, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. Uh, sure. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Allahu Akbar. I thought I should already. Okay. I repeat again, repeat again. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, they have a three part of question. So now you can see my screen. Okay, this is your exercise. All right. So the first one, you have to complete the dialogues using the vocabulary below. I already put the answer. You just fill in the blend only. Okay, so the meaning words, I already teach you what the meaning of each word there. So number two. You have to translate uh, the sentence below in Malay language. All right. So this sambal belacan. Look at. You can see this. Sambal belacan. No need to translate. Use the same name because this is the name of the food. This sambal belacan. Sambal belacan ini. What the meaning of delicious? Guys. Delicious. What is it? Sedap. Ah, yes. Sambal belacan ini sedap. And then you don't know what the meaning but. So you can use the Google Google Translate, but um, that means is uh, tetapi, okay? Sambal belacan ini sedap, tetapi it's too spicy. What meaning spicy, guys? Pedas. Tetapi sangat pedas. Yes, and then finish. Move to the second sentence. I want a cup of less <coughs> of less sweet teh tarik. I want a cup, a cup. That means I want. I like or I want. What meaning I want? Saya mahu or saya suka? Kan? Saya mahu. Ah, so you put the answer. Saya mahu a cup. That means it's a glass. Apa? Teh tarik kurang manis. Less sweet. That means it's kurang manis. Okay, and then you try to do the C, D and E with your own. And then the last part, yes, I would like to uh, please focus this part, okay. Your test to the question similar like this one, 99% similar like this. Not same text, but similar. Of course, not same, but similar. So I just introduced to you your test to the, que the question 
like this one where you have to read the the paragraph first same like test one where you do the oral right you have to read the paragraph and then you have to find the answer based on the text so how to find the answer please find the keyword asam pedas terkenal di negeri mana find the keyword asam pedas terkenal okay let's say the keyword is terkenal okay so find Asam pedas merupakan sejenis hidangan tengah hari yang terkenal. Yes, that one. This is the keyword. Di Melaka. So, the answer is around there. Asam pedas terkenal di negeri Melaka. Yes, is that the answer? Right? So, how to find the, the number two? Yes, find the keyword. You will be fine. The answer. Right? So, this is a mandatory. You have to complete. Uh, this exercise because we have to discuss be, uh, before you uh, attend your uh, second test. All right. So uh, I thought that's all for me. So any question? Are this Everyone, Hello. any question? No question. Lama pagi. Low teacher. Yes. Hello. Yes. Hello. Yes. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. Uh, because my connection is un un unstable. Yes. Hello. What is it? Yes. Hello. Yes. What is it? Hello. Oh, you forgot. Yes. Uh, please repeat again. Sorry, my internet is unstable. What is it? What your question? Yes, Pengdan. Oh no no no. Oh. <laughs> no question. My question. Uh, uh, this. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> I'm. Uh, you. Ask me questions and I write my. I uh, guess. Yes. If you already write, don't worry. Okay, because I have to check your attendance. Who does come from a session 14? Please write down your in-chat box. Yes. I have to box your attendance. Okay, don't worry. Uh, I... Okay. Yes. yes, okay. Okay, so I hope uh, one, uh, since my internet is unstable, so if you still any inquiry or any question, please was at me or drop in WhatsApp group. Yeah, I'll try to reply one by one, okay? So that's all for today. See you again. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. Thank you, Doctor. Bye. 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 Bye, everyone.